What's up, YouTube? It's Optimus P517 coming back at you with a special pickup today, actually. Um, I was sick the last few days. I actually, these came in. Nope. Just throw some fruit. <laughs> but, uh, you know, before I even dive in, Sockany. Uh, you know, you can call it hype, you can call it whatever it is. I bought in, and uh, I'm glad I did actually. So, first off, thanks to T Blake. If you guys haven't checked him out, go check him out. It was his video that introduced me to Sockany. Um, you know, I've seen Eddie win, Yoanni, and, and a bunch of actually those three guys really that's been getting uh, hard into Sockany. Um, I think I, I remember all uh, all things Philly. Um, was talking about Sockney for a while, but what really did it for me was the Grid 9000s. Um, and the shoe is right here. So, the crazy thing, I, I, I don't even know where to start off with this, is I'm blown away just by the shoe itself. Uh, there was a lot of things I didn't even know in details to it that sold me even more once I got these on hand. And that's the crazy part, but man, first off, again, thanks again, T Blake. I know you got you, you got yours on the hookup deal, uh, but big shout out, definitely pushing the grid 9000s. And I will say the grid 9000s, I'm very happy and pleased with it. And I I believe this is going to be my first of many pairs of grid 9000s that uh, I'll be picking up this year with uh, Saucony. So uh, the, the for me, I don't even know how to explain it. It's just first new shoe, new brand that I'm trying out. Asics never did it for me, so Asics is out the door. I'm done. It's forever done unless they, they do something for wide footer, but it's true to size. This is one thing. It was very forgiving on my feet. I tried them on. They're comfortable as hell as well. And the cool thing is the uh, sticker price is 100 bucks. So you can't really beat that, right? Um, God, man, I, I want to go on on this video for forever about this, but I just don't even know how to start with it. I, I really want to show you the details. Um, very pleased and happy with it. Unfortunately, if you guys are trying to go after a pair of these, these are sold out. Uh, definitely crazy. There was a blue one, there was a green one. I really want to get the green ones now. So if anybody can find me a pair of the green ones in size 11, Hit this boy up because I'm ready to pay for them. Um, but let me go show you guys these up close because that's where it's at. And then I'm going to show you guys an on feet as well just so you can see what they look like. I've got the other pair on feet already. I, I've tried them on in the house and I really, really like them. All right, gang. So here it is. Just look at the details of it up close on that suede material. It is insane, right? Yeah, it's pretty freaking nuts. So, um, for a hundred bucks, you're getting quite a bit of uh, a suede that should be on freaking Jordans, you know, nowadays and all, and all that other stuff. But man, quality is definitely on point here. You got the leather with the Saucony logo. You got, you know, Saucony on there as well. And then the interesting kind of a you know not a lace lock but it's kind of a reinforcement right here but the laces is uh this is kind of a slip-on system so it's it's the spongy uh, uh, bungee cord kind of a deal and you just run it through the lace lock and there is kind of a tip wrapped around it so it won't go through the lace lock but uh it's nice you got the pull tab um oh nice thing i found out is this booty system here so this is very similar to the Jordan 7 but it doesn't go through all the way you can kinda of see it right there it kinda of stops so it does go through and let me focus but it does kinda of go through into there you now you got the midsole or sorry the insole my apologies gosh can't even talk like I said I've been sick man bear with me but the missile is very cushiony you guys can see right there very nice. The nice touch to this is the bottom gum sole. Got all that gum sole juiciness right down there. 
and uh, gives it a very nice simple touch to it and I don't know if this is a functional uh, air pocket or anything or just a uh, aesthetic thing but it was kind of a cool touch to it but overall man these grid 9000s they are definitely one hell of a shoe so you know you can't go wrong with them the only thing that I found that wasn't you know once you got them on feet they're not too bad but the only thing that I found kind of an issue was the craftsmanship right around the midsole and the glue and, and whatnot so if you guys can kind of see you know something like that um, it's just little stuff around it but like I said man once you've once you've got them on feet whatever as long as they hold up um, that's perfectly fine but these I think are gonna be my new daily daily wear shoes I can't say they're my beaters cuz man these are for a hundred dollar shoe they should be a pair of beaters but damn these are so nice you don't want to beat them so unless you got like three four pairs just sitting around waiting for you to cycle through it but uh there you have it man these are the Saucony grid 9000s let me throw these bad boys on feet so you can see what they look like from your angle alright gang here they are uh, I've got some shorts on and basically Definitely great with jeans, great with khakis, uh, summer shorts, basketball shorts, whatever you want to wear. And like I said, these are comfortable. These are very comfortable on feet. Great for me. True to size. Um, you might be able to even go half a size down to get a better fit. But these definitely work great. Um, true to size, like I said. And there you have it. Can't go wrong with them. So, hope you guys like this review. Make sure to rate, comment, and subscribe. And then also, something I've always been forgetting to mention in a lot of my videos, go ahead and follow me on Twitter. Go ahead and follow me on Instagram. It is also OptimusP517. And then other than that, peace out.